We start planning this before the Christmas break, getting everything organised, getting parent volunteers. There's a lot into this actually. Once it's all planned, it sort of runs itself. I guess it's just a community thing people do. It's really just an opportunity for the kids to get outside, um, practice a lot of the skills they've learnt in PE. Some of the main stuff, we've, we use, we've done basketball. We do a lot of tag games with this age group, so they're just learning just to move. Spatial awareness is a massive one. Coordination skills are important in all of these. Most of the things we do aren't overly competitive because we don't really want to make win or lose a big part of the activity. But one thing we really try to do is just teach the kids that they have to learn how to fail or lose, if you like, in these game situations. Teachers are often sort of more concerned than the kids, to be honest, about being out in the field. The kids usually enjoy it. And we use water because we're in a hot, country, so obviously it keeps them cool, allows them to participate properly for the whole two hours. The feedback's usually really positive. I think it's a nice change for the kids and it's something different than just your nine to five. My name's Brent Chesterman, I'm one of two PE elementary teachers at Saigon South International School.